Over the last couple of years, Bogus Basin has been adding new attractions and events in an effort to make it a year round recreation area for families. One of the new attractions, wildly popular mountain coaster. But for a Boise man who gets around on a scooter, getting on the line to ride it wasn't possible until today. Alex Livingston has his story. This summer up at Bogus Basin has been full of fun and activities, but for one local man who primarily gets around on a scooter, that fun was cut short when he realized getting onto the mountain coaster wasn't exactly easy. The mountain coaster at Bogus Basin is one of the more popular new attractions at the resort. No one had ever told me what it was like. So it was all in my imagination what I would be like. So it's no wonder Gordon Myrie wanted to test it out for himself. In his mission to get on the coaster, he quickly came across some roadblocks. Most places have made things real accessible. The ride was not so accessible. Gordon was diagnosed with MS nearly three decades ago, and this scooter is how he gets around. They said, now how am I going to get there? Yeah. Well, there's a road that goes over there, they said. Well, I took my scooter at the end of the road. Well, then the road was blocked off. Well, and then when you get, once you get to there, then you still have stairs to go up. Without a ramp. I just don't know how they can get me up steps. His goal of riding the coaster was squashed. Yeah, as much money as they spent to put this in, you would have thought they would have thought about accessibility because that's high in everybody's idea when they build buildings nowadays. But today, that all changed. Welcome to the Glade Runner. How are you today? I'm good, young man. How are you? Doing very well. Four Bogus Basin employees carried him up those stairs in a wheelchair. Once they started ca carrying me up, I wasn't nervous at all. I felt pretty comfortable. Right in line. If he'll lift, oh, yeah, lift my legs up for me. And off he went. Bye. Bye. While Gordon was able to eventually ride the coaster. You have a good ride? Absolutely. I'm going to do it again. The situation could happen again to someone else. The director of mountain operations, Nate Shake, says the ride was actually designed to have a ramp with it. Unfortunately, due to the construction season last season and then getting started this season and contractor availability, et cetera, we haven't built the ramp yet. Shake says until then. Hey, we are on a mountain and that makes things difficult at times to get around and move around. Um, so folks need to ask us for help and we're more than happy to provide that. The designs are drawn and the plans are in place to put a wheelchair ramp here at the mountain coaster to make it easy for everyone by this fall. At Bogus Basin, Alex Livingston, Idaho's News Channel 7.